Hi there, it's Miss Novakowski coming to you from the studio. Today I'm going to show you how to make an origami heart. All right, to make one of these origami hearts, you need a square piece of paper. And I'm going to start, I'm going to make, I want mine to be pink, so I'm going to put the pink side down. If you have white paper, you can use white paper and then just decorate it or paint it afterwards. So you start with the bottom corner and you will help oh, some troubles here, fold it up to the top. So we're creating a big triangle or mountain. Go over your crease, open it up and you see the fold line across and you rotate it and then do the same fold again from the bottom up to the top. And now when you open it up, what we visualize, you'll see four triangles there. And now you go from the bottom corner, and you're gonna to go to the center point where these two fold lines intersect. And I'm gonna hold that at the center point there with this finger, and then with my other hand, I'm gonna crease the bottom. Then I rotate it so that I've got the triangle that I just folded at the top here. And now, I'm gonna take the bottom corner, but I'm not gonna stop at the center point. I'm gonna go all the way to this top fold here in the center. And I'm gonna bring this right up to there. Again, hold it with one finger, and then with the other hand, use those fingers to form the crease. So this next step is the trickiest in this heart. You just have to really look for your center fold line there. If you can't see it very well, then just fold in half, just to sort of again, see where that center line is. Then I'm gonna take the bottom part here and fold this up, and I'm gonna match this fold here to my center fold. And you can see how that's half of a heart is starting to form there. Then I'm gonna do the same thing here. So this fold here is gonna come up and match to the center, so I'm gonna turn it up. And match it to the center. So now I have quite a pointy heart, so I'm going to soften those points and form it to look more like a heart. So I'm going to flip it over. I'm going to take that top point and fold it down to the fold line, and I just go a little bit over so I can tuck it under. Same on this side, fold it down to that fold line, and then I can tuck it under just a little bit. And then I'm just going to take these two corners here and fold them in to help again shape my heart. There, and then when I flip it over, there I have my heart shape. You can see I've made quite a collection of origami hearts here. Then you could take your heart if you want and glue it onto the front of a card to give as a gift to someone or a note to someone. And I've also made this bookmark. Here, I just glued uh, origami heart onto a thicker piece of paper and you can put someone's name on or a message on the bookmark. 